The war in Ukraine causing a lot more than just heartache abroad, but pain at the pump here. Gas prices have risen at historic rates, and economists worry they'll soon reach record highs. And in North Carolina, AAA says the average price of gas currently at $3.93. In South Carolina, it's $3.88. Well, new tonight, Queen City News reporter Sydney Heiberger breaks it all down for us and tells us it's impacting more than just drivers. Oh, this is going to hurt. National gas prices reached more than $4 a gallon on Monday, according to AAA. That's 45 cents more than a week ago, 62 cents more than a month ago, and a buck 30 more than last year. As a mobile business, we really rely on the fuel economy um, to be the cost to be down. It's not just drivers that are hurt by these staggering prices. Businesses that rely on fuel like mobile landscapers say the rapid rise has hurt their bottom line. A typical uh, truck would uh, utilize at least about on average uh, $40 to $50 today for mobilization. Um, as it stands now, it's that cost has gone up to about $70. And as if prices at the pump didn't hurt enough, the extra costs incurred by these businesses are also passed on to the consumer in the form of increased rates. The rapid surge is directly correlated to the war in Ukraine, but prices were on the rise well before that, as U.S. oil drilling had started to slow and foreign oil powers kept their oil supplies under a tight rein. Oil is a global market, so uh, if it goes up in one place, it goes up, it goes up everywhere. Expert energy economists like Peter Schwartz predicts prices could hit around 450 a gallon before they start to come back down. The best hope for any relief, peace. Until the situation's resolved, we're going to be looking at very high oil prices. Sydney Heiberger, Queen City News.